Good morning, guys. Welcome to Monday. It's raining. It's raining, and I got my trailer back. I'll show you what they did. They uh, strengthened the back up. Uh, they they welded that. Oh, that hurt. They welded that. It's pointy. They welded this extra piece on there. Unfortunately, the springs I had were the wrong ones. They didn't go on. So I have to send the springs back that I bought and then put new springs back. They fixed all the rust at the top where that light was, that corner. And then that corner they put new metal and they welded it. See the metal there? And they welded that. Put another brace on this side, strengthen it. Piece of metal that runs inside here, which is really good and strong. So he just checked that out. So now the door is fixed. The only thing is I need to get new springs. And then once all the springs are done, once all the springs are done, then I have a person that I might bring this to to sandblast the whole thing and then we can get it repainted so that's my goal is to get it repainted I don't know when I'm gonna do that because the best time for me to do that is in the winter time when we don't use the trailer that much but if I'm trailering a horse every week for lessons in the winter time then obviously it can't be in the winter time so it has to be sometime in between winter <laughs> and horse show season. Well, they're suggested is I get it all sandblasted, bring it back to him. He'll check all the welds and fix all the welds around everywhere just to make sure, even though he's already checked it, but you know, there's a little bit of rust and stuff. So do all that and then get it painted. So that's my goal. And then maybe get it wrapped. I don't know about wrapping, but I'll have to look into that too. But. Morning guys, welcome to Monday. It's only Monday. Wow, I, I just, in the summertime just flies by. Welcome to today's video. We have a busy week, a busy week you guys, but we woke up this morning and it was winter. We woke up, it's 58 degrees today. Yesterday was like 100 degrees, today's 58 degrees. Huge culture shock. So where did you get that? Um. Oh, a friend sent it? Yeah, with the pink. Yeah, oh, so I need to take a picture of that and show her that you've been using it. I remember that, it's so gorgeous. It doesn't fit Willow. Doesn't fit Willow, but it fits honey. It just fits honey. So this is the week that we planned to have all of our family stuff, like the whole week we have family stuff planned. Oh wait, this is when Julia's coming over? Yeah, like everybody's coming. I thought that was next Oh, and this weekend we're having like a big party. And it's freezing. It's like winter. Maybe the next couple of days are cold like this. Hurry! Hey. <laughs> are you afraid? No, Did... I watched a horror movie last night. You watched a horror movie last night? Yeah. With your friend? Yeah. Oh. It was my It's fine. Oh, cool. It's fine. Good girl, Kirby. Get away. Are you trying to say Ellie isn't listening? You want in? Come here. I have to figure out how to tie this thing up. Now that it's winter. Hey, good girl, Kerb. I can see why she came running. Why? Oh. <laughs> Where's Ellie? Oh, your braids came out. And why are you all wet and dirty? Oh yeah, because it rained this morning. Ellie! Oh gosh. Where is Ellie? Oh gosh, don't run off, dude. That little pony definitely freaks me out. Like if anybody's gonna kick somebody, it's gonna be her. She heard us and she came running. Yeah, aw, she wants out, that's true. She's like, what are we doing today? It's funny because when Honey hears they Sophie's voice, the gate yeah, they're like, oh no, we're not going under there now. When she hears Sophie's voice or Sophie calling, she comes flying. You should brush her, give her a good brush. I might brush She's my horse wet. too. I'm not doing that. 
Oh, you gotta wait till she dries? Yeah. Essentially, I need to get ready for this weekend. And it rained for the last three days. Not a lot, but it rained a lot last night. You guys are getting dirty! Don't run and poop! Oh my. This is gross mud. Hi, Willow! It's freezing. Yeah, they ripped it off the wall. So either they're using it or they're breaking it. My little pad there. I know, I hate those things anyways. Well, they must be using it. I'm actually just remembering what fall is like. <laughs> what winter is like. While I love the fall weather, I hate the mud and the gross for the horses. All right, you're gonna have to pick her feet. Walk to sleep. Hi, baby. <laughs> she always is doing that tongue thing. I feel like there's a ton to do. Sam's gotta push the poop back. We need to cut the grass. <laughs> like there's a lot. To pick up the dog poop, that'll be the girl's job. I always let them do that. There's just a lot to do because there's our family are all sleeping over and it's just gonna be busy and you want everything to look nice. I wanna clean up the horse paddock. That's what I was planning to do today, but it rained and it's all wet. She's just happy to be having something to do. It's literally so cold that Sophie wants to close the door. We want to close the door. 58 degrees, you guys. I feel like this is a great reminder for us to check blankets, wash blankets. We don't even know if anything fits her. Yeah, oh my gosh, we have a new horse. We don't even know if we have a blanket for her. I bet you Chino's blankets would fit her. But we use Storm, Chino's heavy blanket for Storm. Anyway, we got all, but she probably never wore a blanket in her life. It's cold. It's cold, I know. It's Sam's like, it's so cold. What? The dogs are here. You can take them inside with you if you want. Yeah. We close the door. No, the wind. It's cold. Not only do we need to get ready for our party this weekend, but we have other guests coming this week. Plus, we need to get ready for winter. We have to clean up this barn, pack everything, like clean it all up, and get ready for winter. I have to still finish Sophie's curriculum for school. She's doing a lot of online stuff this year, like most years. But we have some really fun, cool courses that she's gonna do this year. I'm so excited. Like her math this year is money math, and she loves money math. No. You don't love money math? I don't love any math. She doesn't love any math. But if she's good at any math, it's money math. Anything that has to do with money, Sophie's okay. good at. So, so I have all this stuff to do, and I'm just sitting here. I did a lot of stuff this morning. I did like a lot of curriculum stuff for Sophie this you know morning. What I did this morning. Slept. Yeah. That's, <laughs> That's gonna end soon. You guys, we have like three weeks till school goes back. Is it three weeks till school goes back or two? Uh, two weeks from tomorrow? Two. two weeks from tomorrow, school goes back. Holy moly. We still have to go back to school shopping. We have a lot to do. Sophie's getting ready for a championship. Did I tell you guys Sophie made it to the championship? I feel like I used up all my energy last week. <laughs> this is a rest week. And it's the week I have so much to do. <laughs> so I'm going to have to rise above it. And I'm going to have to get up there. And I'm going to have to do all the stuff I need to do. I feel overwhelmed because everything feels messier when it's wet and gloomy out. Does that, does that happen to you? Do you feel like everything feels more overwhelming and messier and gloomier? Like no matter what you do, when it's rainy and wet, it doesn't look good? I don't even know why we kept this blanket. This blanket's gotta go in the garbage. Because well, I don't get honey and honey It's, it's like, ripped. Well, it still works. <laughs> it apparently works the same. I mean, I could sew that, that's easy. Maybe that's what I was thinking. And then we have, I'm gonna wash these this year. And then we have that's storms. Big on storm, though. Is it big on storm? Yeah. You want it for lady? No, lady needs pink. Needs pink. <laughs> I know. Penny lady never lady. breaks her blanket. Penny's blanket's always good. Because lady, Penny stays awake. It's ripped. Except for this year. <laughs> what? Is this Penny's? Yes. Well, I can see through that. I don't even know why it's up there. All right, so. Get a pen and a paper. We gotta make a list. That's why we have phones. Yeah, get your phone out. Hey. Storm has a good blanket. Uh, Can we wash that? Yeah, we'll wash them all. You know what we should do? We should, well, I can't do it today because it's gonna be a mess I'm and we're getting ready. All pink blanket. All right, I know exactly where we can go to get her blanket. It's all pink. She loves it. If you let her choose between the blue or the pink, she's choosing pink. Yeah, so um, Storm has a blanket. Willow has a blanket. Gracie. What did Gracie have last year? 
We gotta get rid of all of our broken blankets. We gotta make a list. We gotta get blankets this year. New blankets. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna look online and see what I can find. And look, it's maybe I kept them so I could see what size they were. I, I know that Penny's like a 76. Willow's is a bit big on her. We'll look and see what we can find. Storm is basically the only one with a blanket. I think Gracie's. Is he the one that does all the ripping? Yeah, Storm's the one that does all the ripping. Gracie's is also like ripped. Storm. That's ripped. Yeah, but it went to storm. Well, it's too big for storm. That's what I said. You want to try it on Lady? Not today. I just put her back up. It'll probably fit Lady more than Storm. Lady ah. needs a pink blanket. Like, come on now. Everybody can wear any color. I feel like we should get all of our blankets the same color and just buy everybody a new blanket this year. No, not the same color. Then you won't know who's who's. They're all different sizes. Lady will be an 81, Storm will be a 78, Penny will be a 76. We don't know if those are sizes. Those sizes I'm sure of. It's the ponies that are troublesome for me. Wow, that's not a warm one. And that, I don't think that one's Gracie's. Did we get Gracie a new one last year? Honey's blankets don't fit her anymore. Yeah, that's in perfect condition. No, we're gonna keep it because... I know, this is a full blanket. Are you complaining that my dog won't follow you? Yeah, she doesn't listen. She follows me. She's trained to follow one person. All right, new blankets for everyone. And I want the same color. No, I've I want like the same pink. blanket. I mean, Gabby wants bright pink. What if it's the same style, just a different blanket color? Same style, different color. I want yeah, all the girls want. to have the same color and then all the boys, the one boy to have. See, they put a... Wow. Put a bar there. To they did a great that. job. They fixed this one, which is all, remember, it was all yeah. ripped. They put a piece there. All right. Well, we've had this done before, but they, this guy did a really good job. Are you happy with the trailer? I'm happy with it. It's old and dark you and dungy, but it is the truck. coolest trailer. Our horses will love this trailer, all except for Penny. But I think Penny just doesn't like any trailer, really. But I love this trailer. It's easy for them. They can see when they're going in. I hate side slant trailers. So if we were to buy a new trailer right now, it would be the same trailer that we have right now. All right, I'm gonna go in and look up horse blankets. I'm so excited to shopping online for horse blankets. But also I wanted to just tell you guys that ever since we got the puppy, she pulls Ellie's ponytail out of her head. And it's so annoying. You guys, it's gonna get down to 11 degrees, which is like, almost free freezing it's 11 degrees above freezing let's just wait let's give them some food because they never get food today's special meal is pasta oh they might eat it they want in these guys want in and these guys want out <laughs> There you go. Nighttime treat. The, watch the turkeys. The turkeys will take it right out of your hand. Here comes Tom. He's getting ready to jump. <laughs> I love my turkeys. I knew I was going to love my turkeys. <laughs> the chickens are like, oh, why'd you have to go and let them out? Yeah. We're leaving. I mean, the ducks, yeah. I can't wait for fall. I'm wipe my hands on you. No, no, no. This is my. You my, already have stuff on you. My hoodie. You I'm, already have stuff on, on my pants. Here, hold this. Oh my gosh. That's it, dude. <laughs> Look at Biscuit, she's so fluffy. I love the chicken barn gobble, gobble. with the light on at night. And I look outside and it's all light and beautiful. I just love watching them though. Right, let's, go. let's go. Anybody who chases me is getting this bag Get to the head. <laughs> Don't chase me. Don't chase me. Don't chase me. Don't chase me. Gosh. All right, you guys go eat your special snack. 
We'll be back out to tuck you in. I swear to God, there's something wrong with my brain. It's like this, something got flipped on where I used to like feel or see negative stuff or bad stuff. I don't see it anymore. I could smell the smell and I'm like, what's that smell? It's so beautiful. It's a skunk, <laughs> but it's not that it's beautiful. It's that it's familiar and I feel like I was anticipating, I was anticipating like a fire, a wood stove, and I could smell that and it's skunk. Like I can't even tell the difference between good and bad right now. Here, cutie. He's heavy now. There's my little piggy boy. What is on his side? Oh. Two pigs in one video. See them both together? I'm coming. I have to show you this. So the pigs, pigs are, I love pigs. Pigs are really funny how they sleep. They like to burrow. And when it's hot out, like when I come down and it's hot out, this guy has three little blankets in his bed. Uh, I'm gonna take them up. I don't even know how I'll wash these because I might just have to toss them and get them new ones because all the hay is gonna clog up my washer. Anyways, I come down in the morning and he's like got all of his blankets into a bed and it's just so cute. All right, I put them all in the corner there for him. But look at this. Look at this. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see it. Can you guys see that they're in the camera screen? It doesn't look like you can see it, but there's like a trench. Somebody built a trench in here. There's hay there, hay on this side. It's a trench, it's the pig. It's adorable. When I come in in the morning, the first thing I see is his chubby little butt laying there and he's so cute. Come on in. I smell a skunk still. Come on in. Don't let any skunks in. Oh, hello. <laughs> He comes out to check on me. Do you have my food? Come on. Hello, piggy. Oh no, not you guys. You gotta wait for your slow owner. Okay. Oh, Posey's already in there. When I came down this morning to do chores, Posey was underneath her sleeping bag, that red blanket. She was underneath it. I gotta get her some fresh water. Oh. Wow, you give everybody a lot of grain. Yes, you do. No wonder where we run out so fast. Wow, bring out the camera, they behave for once. Yeah, they behave. Bring out the what? Camera. Bring out the camera, they behave. I'm, going in there. I'm telling you now, if I come face to face with a skunk now or in the morning, I'm not gonna be happy. Little Mia's in here. It's our girl chicken that's laying on eggs. We have three broody chickens right now. Sophie puts food in there every day for her. Well, we have four, including her. Four broody chickens. Everybody wants to be a mama right now. It's One doesn't even have eggs. Yeah. We take their eggs, they still lay there. No, but the one doesn't even have an egg. Not at all. She's never had one. She's got six eggs underneath her. Now I'm wishing I had to put more because... She's small, she can't take care of that many. Sure she can. But could you imagine her running around this barn with her little baby chicks? <laughs> I can't wait. Every time we start to let a uh, chicken rear up some babies, I always like, cancel it halfway because it's it's always so annoying we've just never had the right setup for that but i feel like this barn would be such a good place she can have a whole stall if she wants the smell of skunk is getting stronger sophie don't blame that on me <laughs> you go first <laughs> oh my gosh it smells like it's coming from that way the turkeys are on the van the turkeys, oh my gosh. Like, actually. Oh, don't tell dad. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> you know this is not your house. Oh, hi. You know dad is gonna kill you. Come on. Get down. Come on. Come on. Get down. Oh, okay, I can't, here. <laughs> Can't do it with one hand. 
Stay off the truck or you're grounded. Grounded. You're all grounded. They're the best though. They're, they're the best. They uh, don't chase me. I know. By far. I want to them great. The best little creatures we own. And you guys too. No, not these ones. These are our, these are our. <laughs> and close the door fast, guys. Because they want to come in with us. You'd be shocked at all the good food we have inside. You'd love it in there. Don't peck me. Don't peck me. Don't do it. Okay, how am I getting in? Don't you know that you're beautiful?